What's up people, Sorab here with a new episode of UE4 Quick Tutorials. In this episode, I'm going to quickly show you how to use a blueprint function library. Often during the development of your projects, you discover the need of pieces of code that is used over and over again. You can use functions for this purpose, of course, but functions that you create in a blueprint class can only be accessed from that class. So the question is, what if you wanted to use a function everywhere? And the answer is, you can use a blueprint function library. As an example, we'll create a function to show and hide the mouse cursor, which can be called from any blueprint. This can be useful for menus, inventories, or gameplay sections that you need a mouse cursor for. So to start with, we right click in the content browser and under blueprints, you find the blueprint function library. Afterwards, double click on that and uh, under the blueprints tab, you, you can create new functions by clicking on the function plus button here or there is an add new button. So as I said, we want to show and hide the mouse when this function is executed. So we call this show mouse. This is a pretty basic script right here just get the player controller I then set the input mode to game and UI and then just Set show mouse cursor to true. And then for hiding the mouse, you can basically do the same thing, just a little different. Yes, and uh, that's basically it. And uh, we can actually test this just to see if it works. So when I press X, it shows the mouse. And when I press it again, it hides the mouse. Just use a flip flop to do that. So let's see. As you can see, the mouse is shown, and you can still play the game because of the node that we used in the show point. And if I press the X, it just doesn't show anymore. That's it for this time, guys. Ho hope you like the video, and thank you for watching.